you're working on your image, the same one we've been working on for a while, you want to make some minute changes to the image. So you blow it up. But when you blow it up, you're not really getting the big picture anymore. You're only getting that little tiny area. So I want to show you a way that you can work on an image by blowing it up, just like a watchmaker would like to blow up a little tiny watch when they're working on it, and still see the big picture in another image. So start out by going up to the word window on the pull down menu, going into images. Incidentally, here is another place to get your other panels. But go into images and go into new window. What you have now are two windows of the same image. That's important to remember. It's not a different image, it's the same image. Now we're going to come down into our layout here, and we're going to go, say, side by side, all column. On this one, what I'm going to do is pick up my zoom tool, and I'm going to zoom in on, see this rock right here? Let's make that a little bit smaller. I'll use my shortcut key. That's the command or control key in Windows Command on a Mac in the plus and minus keys. I don't think that rock belongs there. But if I work on it over here, I don't get the big picture. So you have the best of both worlds here. Now I'm going to show you a tool that we're going to get into more later, but it's this one right here. It's a healing brush. I'm going to come over here. Notice the size of my brush. Here's a shortcut for you when you're working with brushes. If you use the left and right bracket keys, you can make the brush bigger or smaller. Now check this out. I'm going to come over here and I'm going to paint over that rock. Just like that. Now tell you what, before I let go of my mouse, look over at the image on the right where the rock is. I could say voila, it's gone. So I have the best, as I said, of both worlds here. I have the ability to blow it up really big so I can see what I'm doing and still keep an eye on if it's working in the big picture using multiple window. I can close this one down if I want to. And there you go. We're back to Stonehenge minus one rock.